logo for equal housing opportunity and the international symbol of access, Overture Muller Apartments nestled among green spaces and ponds with Austin, Texas in the distance. Text, Gwen Chance, retired early childhood educator. I never thought about moving into an apartment, but when I saw this apartment, it just was so exciting and I gave the other no other thought. Text, Pete Koiza, retired international petroleum negotiator. Key Koiza, lifetime volunteer. I just think that the decor downstairs is outstanding. Flames dance over glass beads in a fireplace. It looks like a luxury hotel. When you do walk in from the front, the eyes of the guests that are coming to see us say, my goodness, but this looks like a resort. Yeah. <laughs> Lisa walks into the foyer arm in arm with a woman carrying flowers and smiling. This place really does look like a resort when you walk in, but it still feels homey. Text, Lisa Pizinger, homemaker. You really have neighbors and people who you know that live here, and I like that. I'm kind of a newspaper junkie. I, I bet that the computer was a fad and was going to go the way of the hula hoop, and I was going to mess with the computer. I'm starting to reconsider my position on that now. Gwen Chance smiles and laughs with a neighbor while in an audience watching a woman speak. I wanted a place that took care of me in a way, meaning they plan many things. Gwen laughs with neighbors at a cocktail table. Gwen takes a fitness class. But not only that, it met my needs in terms of the accommodations within my apartment. Everything that I wanted and needed was there. From above. A pond with a fountain among trees and manicured lawns with a pathway winding along it. The location is fabulous. You can walk to grocery stores, you can walk to restaurants, there's theaters by here. I like to be out and about also, and I'm still able to be out and about. The Austin skyline. We go on little trips, day trips, whatnot, and I think it, it, the location really helps us. It's a lot easier to drive east-west in Austin than it is north-south. Crossing highways from above. You don't have to get on the racetracks, I-35, Mopac. A woman decorates a mug. I was looking for a place for my mom to live long-term, somewhere that I would want to live. You know, if I was looking for myself, that's what I wanted for my mom. And I could definitely see myself living here in the future. It's hard to say apartment, because when you tell people you live in an apartment, they immediately think you're living in a senior citizen's community. And to me, it's not a, it is, but it's not. Gwen plays bocce. Text, Barbara Mindlin, homemaker. We were able to sell our house and put some money in the bank. It's an adventure. New neighborhood, new friends. Neighbors tend to a garden. It's a community of mature adults to keep us active and involved and just enjoying life, and that's what I love about it. Gwen chooses food from the Continental Breakfast. I like the Breakfast Club. Uh, we come downstairs in the morning. We talk about what we're going to do for the day or, or what happened over the evening before. Neighbors sit, eat, laugh, and cheers with their coffees. The Continental Breakfast here is really very, very nice. It's diverse in many, many ways, people coming from all over. If I had to describe the Overture community, the one thing I would say is just a beautiful community. Maybe the word beautiful, it really is. A man plays a piano while people gather around. If I had to describe Overture in one word, I think it's really welcoming. Keith throws a bocce ball and it comes very close to the jack. I would say excellent. What would you say? I'm comfortable with that one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. A woman smiles at cocktail hour with a glass of wine. I would say adventure. Logo for equal housing opportunity and the international symbol of access. Text, Overture Muller, 55 plus active adult apartment homes, OvertureMuller.com, Graystar.